Prime? That's, that's yeah. the mumbo jumbo skin. The mumbo? <laughs> Wait. Yeah, it's based on mumbo. Yeah, it's just mumbo. It, the pink represents mumbo. Oh, okay, okay. And the yellow. He, well, his shorts are already yellow. Oh, yeah, so that makes sense. Okay. Three, All right, sick. We got some more in chat. Go! Right, interesting, just going opting for the immediate roll to get past the uh, to start off laser. Yeah, I, ha I have watched Unleash's um, Unleash's banjo, so I uh, I have picked up a couple of things about this this character. I wonder if like what difference I'll, I'll see in Skew's play with with like Unleash's. Hmm. I do notice with Unleash's that um. He goes a lot with the. He, he moves a lot with the egg grenade setups and like using the the Briegel blaster. But it might be the same we see with Skew because right now he was often go for Briegel blaster. And that's not yeah. Because they like uh, one of the things that Un Unleash really abused for Sea Bass was that he do like a like, he do like short hop um, egg into like the the Briegel blaster just one shot in order to like kind of set up like a a wall that you can't really jump over and like you just have to kind of take it to shield. Right now, already wasted like three of his Wonder Wings. Only have two more left for the stock. And like, the thing is that like Wonder Wings is also an important recovery tool too. So not not having that really nurse your recovery, not uh, as well as your kill power. All right, DNA playing pretty well uh, right now. Just able to minimize his like he's, he's been in disadvantage for a while, but oh. like he was able to minimize it until he SD. Oh, I like the movement right there. Opting to like. Fox try to pick back in order to avoid the up smash. Mm -hmm. I like him in the space right there. Ooh, obstacle for Dare. DNA trying to find out this kill, but like, Skew making it really, really t uh, difficult for him. Good saving of the jumps. Oh, wow, nice down tilt. Oh, he could have got that stock right there. But good awareness of DNA, it would go up with the Falco fantastic. Yeah, Skew's jumping a lot. It feels like. DNA is starting to really, uh, like, catch on to it. So I, I wonder if Skew might try to, you know, uh, watch how he's jumping, or if maybe DNA is going to keep on exploiting that until, uh, until he gets the kills he's looking for. Oh no, that was, that was unfortunate. You hate to see it, yeah, because uh, we saw him grab earlier, because he was expecting to get the fastball, uh, get the drag down fair. So, you know, uh, DNA definitely kind of thrown off uh, his rhythm. Ooh, goes for the fair. Good air dodge down. Oh, right now, this is pretty bad for DNA. Can't really get back on the ledge. Ooh, Did he just drop the grenade there? It, it kind of looked like he pressed down B again from, like, the, the sound. Hmm. By the way, very interesting uh, ledge trap. Oh, he's just running around. He he's just running around with his strap. But that's the oh, thing. If you uh... oh, that's not it. Ooh, nice tech. Saves a it saves a jump. Dina, Dina right now uh, in a very poor position. Both side B and bomb are gonna kill. Yeah, that's gonna murder him. Yeah, I, I, that's what I was talking about. You know, side B killing. Unfortunate roll coming out from Dina. Uh, it just it got scouted and you got very hard punished for it. Hmm. I wonder if you might opt for like a bigger stage because it feels like he he didn't really have the like uh, the room to kind of mix up how he was approaching. So um, uh, what's his face? Skew was just kind of able to uh, anti him every time he tried to like get in or just you know punish the uh, attempted approach options. Like I, I can definitely see a, 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 a like a stage like I don't know. E even Battlefield being better, just the fact that he has the side plat uh, platforms to work with. But like PS2, uh, like Town, and um, yeah, and PS2 and Town definitely seem to like, be like his best bets because just not having like the platform available when uh, to him when like Ski was in the corner made it really hard to kind of mix up how he was gonna pressure him. Right, so why are they not starting? <laughs> Give me a second. Maybe they're pondering the great mysteries of life. They're having a truly 
deep in-depth discussion about the uh, the rareware lore. What? <laughs> the what war? <laughs> rareware. You know, all the games, like, you know, maybe they're all in the same universe. Who knows? Only they do. <laughs> Only they do. I'm so lost. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just going to say, I'm just going to nod and say yes. <laughs> mm -hmm. Sometimes that's, that's, that's the best choice in life. You just yeah. nod your head and then you walk out of the meeting and you ask your coworker, what just went on in there? <laughs> yeah, we've all had moments like that. <laughs> All right, looks like he's switching. Oh, okay. I was gonna say he's switching off of Falco. I don't know. I don't know who else, who other than Falco that he plays. Probably Inkling or uh, oh, Inkling yes. would be the only character I can think of. He does have an Inkling. I forgot about that. I haven't seen that thing in a while though. Let's hope that uh, yeah, DNA is the coworker who actually paid attention during the meeting. So that way he can uh, really figure out what to do in this game too, because he really needs to, uh, to find the answers quick. Right, really like how he's kind of changing around. He's using laser more as a as a bait tool rather than a, a hard zoning tool like he was in the first game. It seems to be really putting in work. Ooh, obstacle! Wow, that was actually interesting off the laser right there. Let's get that small conversion. Mm -hmm. All right, so yeah. Uh, He's, this is looking a lot different than the last game, but oh, he just explodes and no. it's now a really bad position to be in. Great call out though on the no air, air dodge. Okay, he's DNA looking down but not out, really uh, keeping up the pressure. Good stuff though, Skew fighting his way out disadvantage, making it really hard for um for DNA to kind of like seal wow, out this stuff. he's just getting full on stations for right now. He's really baiting him to like use Reflector because he's able to like opt to go for Wonder Wing after baiting him to like throw out the thing. Throw out the eggs. Yeah, he really wants that, that drag down air grab. Because uh, luckily for DNA though, he gets a pop up. Good shield and that was punish. Good. That was good That's, but the thing is that like he's down 100%. So, you know, even, even when he's able to take the stock, like, excuse. It will bank up a uh, good uh, yeah, lead. That was like a good mix-up right there, because maybe he, he expected to go for back throw, and that's why he wasn't ready to match. Like, that's why he opted to go for down throw right there. Mm -hmm. Wow, nice down throw under the, uh, the laser. That was an actual banjo kazooie maneuver right there. <laughs> My man's platforming in a, in, a, in a fighting game. What is a platform fighting? True. And right True. now, it is looking... It's like a one player game. Right now, this. <laughs> I was gonna say it's looking like a one player game right now. Yeah, those up airs just really able to kind of put DNA in a really bad guess, uh, guessing scenario. Oh my gosh, the falling, uh, that egg placement was so smart because like he fell with the egg so that way DNA couldn't really um, like safely anti air him. Uh, good. Oh, it straight up breaks his neck with that. Yeah, Skew just played so dominant. Like it just felt like DNA always had to guess at what Skew was doing, and he he was he, he wasn't really able to guess right enough to uh, to kind of like keep the game even. Yeah, uh, Skew was really moving really well with Ban with Banjo in terms mm -hmm. of like, especially with his baits throwing out an egg and then like immediately able to like tackle him with Wonder Wing. He was able to secure those early stocks in that whole set. So I don't know who we, get, who we got up next. We shall see. All right, so we are going to be actually having uh, Adamus, or as he will be called for this match, El Bandito for this first match, because he <laughs> so desperately wants me to change his tag to that. And it's gonna be Stan Luna uh, going against him in <laughs> Winter Semis. <laughs> so Al Bandito versus Mr. Luna. Let's see if he can steal all the views from Luna's fan camps and take this W. Yes. Let's hope. <laughs> Let's hope, yeah. <laughs> oh, God. Trevor's taking years off of my life. <laughs> He, he does this to us all. He is a force of nature. <laughs> yes, he is. All right, so... Oh, yeah, ABC Stan Luna. 
Never heard of this player, ever. <clears throat> uh, so we're going to see yeah. how this works out. Yeah, I, I first saw him from, from like last week, and I got top four. So like, apparently he's pretty good, and, and 